Welcome back guys, Undiscovered Taste Bud segment, Beard Bros. Today we're in Dexter, New Mexico at Sandra's Roasted Corn and Shaved Ice in front of the All Subs, 200 East 1st Street. If you could like, comment, subscribe, let's get hungry with us. On guys, hello. Just got to our location. Lake. Some of y'all will look and say it looks familiar. Lake Van oh. here, located in Dexter, New Mexico. Yeah. There's a few flies. So we got a roasted corn. They threw a bunch of ingredients on there: cheese, butter, mayo, mayo seasonings, chili, Valent Valentino sauce, and then we got a couple snow cones. Uh, he got banana. And I got pickle juice. And then for dessert, if it's not enough snacks as it is, we got a chocolate dipped cheesecake. So we'll be trying that here in a minute. Um, let's just dive in. This looks delicious. Shout out to Sandra's roasted corn and shaved ice. Yes. Thank you, Sandra. Boy. I don't think I've ever oh had a corn so God. good. I've never had a corn taste that good. And that was just the first bite. So I'm not having one of these. I've never had one like at the fair or anywhere else. I don't think anyone else is doing them like this. So this is fire. The cook did make a, a uh, he mentioned a little bit to us that the mayo enhances the corn. I think that's what it is. Snow cone, good, but corn, yeah. phenomenal. That's the money maker right there. That thing is amazing. I think they also have canned corn, so if you don't want... Not canned, yeah. cup. Cup corn, sorry. Cu corn in a cup. I'm not gonna lie, this is good. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't want to finish it. Cause I know it's gonna be gone and I'm gonna be sad. And then I kind of like that it gets all over the foil so you can kind of scoop it up and get more. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to lie. This is really good. But I'm intrigued on that. And the cheesecake. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, the cheesecake does look very, very, very enticing. If you want one of these delightful meals right here, they are in Dexter, New Mexico, in front of the Allsup's. Check them out. Check them out. I don't think you'll be disappointed. Mm -hmm. Plus, just to go get out of town, I know it's not far. I'm going to go get you some corn and a shaved ice. Come to Lake Van. Enjoy the, the, the afternoon or the morning or whatever you feel like. And I, I'm telling you, this this is this is good. Like, this is really good. Damn, I don't even, I don't even finish the regular little corn my brother makes about this big. I don't ever finish them. I'm about to finish this whole, like, 10-inch corn. It's good. It's too good to stop eating them. It's like really good. I'm not going to lie. I love every bit of the food we've tried. But this one, I don't know, man. This one's, mm -hmm. this one's up there. This is up there. Like That's good, dog. That was good, good. To so imagine that something so simple as a corn on the cob can like exceed just the fact that it's only a corn on the cob is ridiculous. Yeah, I got to think. Before coming to this place, I ate a lot of food thinking I was like, ah, it's just going to be corn. No, I regret that now because I want to eat another one of these, but I'm full. Oh my God. It was kind of spicy too, huh? That's what made it like a it little It had bit. a little bit of spice. A lot of flavor. Mm-hmm. Like a lot of flavor. With everything going on, it was just like. I mean, hit you from a different angle every time? Yeah, bro. It, it was, was crazy. crazy. Uh huh. It was like a Rob Van Dam frog splash on your mouth every time. It was awesome. We're gonna do the whole cheesecake. I'm just gonna eat it like this with my spoon. Yeah, I'm gonna go right here. Okay. I think it's meant to be eaten like a popsicle. Like a popsicle. Yes. I think we're improvising because it's two of us. Yeah. We didn't get two, so. But it's still good. Mm-hmm. I'm not a fan of chocolate or cheesecake. And yeah. that's really good. Yeah, we don't get to try very many desserts. No, I'm gonna kind of kind of just like dive in because like you said we don't really get to try desserts often. This is finally the first dessert I actually liked. <laughs> this one's good. This one's crazy. I like how it's dipped in like that dipped fudge or chocolate whatever it is. Yeah. I mean not, this is all good. No, I think we just ate. That wasn't good. Again, Dexter, New Mexico. Once this quarantine's Small over. Small little town. Everybody come by. Red truck. Sanders. Shaved ice. Roasted corn. Phenomenal. I, I Highlight was the corn. Without a shadow of a doubt. The corn is just... It speaks for itself. I can't tell you the amount of taste buds I just discovered. Yeah. Like when we tried the ramen noodles, I didn't know they could get that crazy. That's how this is pretty much. Mm-hmm. This is next level. 200 East first. Right across the street from the all -sips. Can't miss them. Tell the beard bros sent you. Tell them that the beard bros sent you. I'm, so, right. I'm so sad I ate all the corn. Me too. All right, let, let us clean up and we'll, we'll get back to you with the nacho in one second. What up, guys? Just got done. I'm not going to say I'm full because I'm not full. No. But my taste buds are wanting more. That corn, I'm not going to lie. If you have not tried Sandra's shaved ice and roasted corn out here in Dexter, New Mexico, 200 East first. First, first right across the street from the Allsup's. You can't miss it. It's a little red. Uh, food truck. I wouldn't even call it a food truck. It's more like a carnival truck, I guess you would say. Like it would be at the fair. He does it at the fair. 
he goes out to hike and spike it, RIP. Um, all, he goes to a bunch of places. He'll Actually, he said he's going to probably be doing the Friday downtown lights thing. Mm -hmm. So, like, around, like, 5 o'clock, 4 o'clock on Fridays, they should have, like, food trucks out there on Main Street to support the local businesses. Um, go check them out. I guarantee you will not regret it. Yeah, I don't think you're going to regret it. I want more, but I'm full because I've ate before this. So, well, we almost just got wetted. We almost got wetted, but we definitely, we stayed hungry. That's what we do with the Beard Bros Undiscovered Taste Buds. Please like, please subscribe. Again, you've, see, you've heard it on the podcast. We're going to preach it here. We're almost at 100 views on our podcast, or 100 videos on our podcast. We're trying to get to 500 before that. Um, and stay tuned also because we'll be doing a big, 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 big giveaway for the 100th video. So, and we're going to be doing something super cool. Just gonna keep you up. We got like 11 episodes till we're there. So stay tuned. Things are coming bigger and better. Thank you guys for the support and love. Till next time with the Beard Bros Undiscovered Taste Buds. Peace.